You are listening to The Lake Program. Today we'll be talking about the government's generous plan to provide every home with plastic sheeting for domestic waterproofing. Before that, we have the chemical forecast. Victoria. Thank you, Albert. We have reports of sporadic downpours of corrosive rain in the western regions. Brothers and sisters, please be careful. Official guidance is to remain undercover for the next 12 hours. Following the recent gas leak at the mid-region power station, there has been an increased risk of widespread contamination. A reassuring statement has been issued by the government to say that decontamination teams will be going in any day now. Thank you, Victoria. It doesn't sound too bad at all out there. Now, I would like to take this opportunity to remind our listeners about the constant threat from the political spies that are known to be operating within our country. As you know, it is important for everyone to remain vigilant. Spies are everywhere, and they are difficult to detect. Take a moment to think about the people you know. Have they been behaving in a strange or subversive manner? Has anyone expressed dangerous political views? As we all know, democracy is dangerous, and any talk of free speech must be stamped out immediately. This is not a story of hope. It's a story of grim reality and a job that needs to be done. After the failed Soviet invasion of 83, the retreating soldiers were quickly replaced by the bitterest winter you can imagine. Nothing in the country worked. We had no food, no fuel, and practically nowhere to live. And our shivering population descended into a nightmare of hunger, disease, and desperation. After waiting for our leaders to do something, anything, there was a change. New leaders rose from the people and established the Republic. We discarded democracy because as our leaders said, democracy means discussion. So let us stop talking and start doing. I guess in a way, the Soviets did win in the end. Gentlemen, as you may have heard, we've had reports of disturbances in the old industrial area last night and by the canal. It would appear, however, that the residential blocks remained relatively quiet. So today I want us to conduct sweeps across the north bank of the canal and across the mid-city area. I want any known subversive brought in. Pro-democracy activists, I want them apprehended too. And that'll be all. Anyway, I don't waste time pontificating on the meaning of it all. As I said, I have a job to do. Ripton, I need to talk to you. There's something I need you to do for me. And we all have our masters. The job I do isn't for everyone. It's just my humble contribution. There are those who make a positive contribution to society, and the others well, I guess they're just part of society. The milk bars or mestos. They sell milk plus to their clientele. Milk with synth mesk or drenchrom. Milk with knives in, they say, to sharpen you up. Real horror show for a bit of the old ultraviolence. It'll be dark soon. We better get going. It's time for another surprise visit. a government, but we don't hear much from them. We certainly don't see them. I guess our leaders think everything is tickety-boo. I suppose it is. We just get on with what we need to do. Maybe they think it all runs like clockwork. Oil production is down 15%.
Coal production is down 32%. Most reserves are reaching exhaustion. Food? Grain production, down. Wheat, maize, barley are all affected. Two desalination plant failures per week on average. Any updates from the Ministry of Truth? Following last week's toxic gas leak in the Mid-Region's power station, we've issued a statement saying that decontamination teams will be going in any day soon. What decontamination teams? What is this? What is it that we must do to bring this writhing serpent back under our control? How is it that our great nation has come to this? Are we to be content with this, this decay? Next, the citizens will be complaining, demanding rights. There'll be talk of democracy once again. It is unacceptable. Whatever it is our leaders are doing, however much I see decay, however much the man in the street hates me, I see a society barely surviving. I see a job to be done. Who the hell are you? What do you want? Get out of my home! Get out! Get out! What is happening with citizen control? The civil fear campaign is going well. We're keeping the Mesto supplied with milk plus, and our agents are fully deployed. I've been looking for you. I see you found another undesirable. This is from the commander. He said to thank you for your work in the industrial area last night. Oh yes. I see a society barely surviving. And a job that needs to be done. 